Thank you so, so much for coming. Uh, I'm Jay Bernhardt. I'm the Dean of Moody College of Communication. It's my great honor and pleasure to welcome all of you today to this very special, very historic milestone in our history. Uh, we're celebrating the five-year anniversary of the naming of the Stan Richards School of Advertising and Public Relations. And even more than that, we're celebrating our continuation as the best school of advertising and public relations in the country. Uh, I'm delighted first to welcome many of our current students who are here with us today. Current students, let me hear you. We're also thrilled today to welcome so many of our world-class faculty and staff. Thank you so much for joining us. And I'm here for you guys. Uh, means uh, papers might take a little longer to grade. Uh, and I'm also thrilled to welcome back many of our esteemed alumni, uh, friends, and industry partners who could join us today. We're really proud of all of your accomplishments uh, uh, that you've uh, uh, served us so well since you've uh, gone on. I particularly want to uh, recognize some members of the Richards Group who are here with us today. Uh, Julia Mel, Chris Farrell, Cheryl Huckabay, Zach Pritchett, Sarah Walker-Hall, Chris Smith, Paul Nelson, raise your hands. We're thrilled you're here, welcome. And many other uh, distinguished uh, guests who are with us today. Thank you so much for being here. Most importantly though, of course, we're here to celebrate and thank the man uh, who we revere, who made th this whole gathering possible, the great Stan Richards himself. <laughs> We thank you, all of us, Stan, we thank you so much for your investment in our college and your belief in our dedication and ability to live up to your standards and expectations. And for those of you who know Stan or who work for Stan, we know that's no small task. Uh, the Stan Richards School of Advertising and Public Relations is made up of the very best faculty and most talented staff of any such department in the country. And I know this as Dean firsthand, because many other great schools are always trying to steal them away from us. <laughs> um, and thankfully, uh, people are so happy here, they really don't leave. We have also been uh, very fortunate to have outstanding world-class students who bring their own ideas and diverse backgrounds and talents to the table, working with our faculty over four, sometimes intense years, to turn some of the finest talent, uh, to turn out some of, of the finest talent in the entire advertising and public relations industries. Uh, we're amazingly proud of our students and the many ways that they take what starts here in the Stan Richards School and go out and change the world. So let's hear it again for our fantastic students. The, the really great thing about being the number one ranked program in the country is that you get a lot of attention, a lot of recognition, and a lot of fantastic students who want to come here. The bad news, of course, about being ranked number one is that there's only one place, direction you can go uh, from there, and that's down. I blew my joke, sorry. Um, uh, uh, but uh, uh, there's only one direction you could go down. We'll edit it in post. Um, uh, which is why it's so important uh, that our school continue to be exceptional uh, and to be run by someone uh, with the experience and the vision and the talent and the drive to keep us number one, to live up to the Stan Richards brand which is why we are so fortunate uh, to recruit Joanne Chirino to be our school director. Joanne's right here, let's give her a hand. <laughs> Joanne's been at the helm of our school for uh, over a year now, and she's already made a major mark on our program. And you'll hear more uh, later today about some of the incredibly exciting things coming in the future. So now it's my great pleasure and honor to introduce our very talented Stan Richards School of Advertising and Public Relations Director, Professor Joanne Sherino. Wow, amazing to see you all. What energy we have in this room. It feels like an advertising and public relations agency. More to come on that. Um, thank you, Jay, Stan, uh, the Richards Group, alumni, friends, uh, students, and colleagues. 
Uh, I'm honored to be here today, first to thank Stan on the occasion of the five-year anniversary of our school naming, and also to share some big news about the future of our school. But before I get to the big news about our school and about our future, I want to recognize my predecessors, Isabella Cunningham and Gary Wilcox. You know, much of the amazing work that we are able to do today and the rankings that we enjoy today um, are due uh, in large part to the strong foundation that Isabella and Gary Wilcox have built. Um, and because I'm both inspired and grateful for her indefatigable efforts to name our school, I'd like to invite Isabella Cunningham up to praise Stan and also share how the naming of our school came about five years ago. Please warmly welcome Dr. Isabella Cunningham. Thank you, Joanne. Um, Stan, it's a privilege for me to stand here and to thank you for your great generosity and for all that you have done with the program. As the longest serving faculty in this school, <laughs> I want to share with you all an important occasion in my life and in my career. Please allow me to take a trip down memory lane. During my second term as the chair of the Department of Advertising and Public Relations, I took on an ambitious task. I wanted to be able to raise enough money to endow a chair that would allow us to recruit an exceptional faculty member. I visited with some people who had supported our program in the past to ask them to guide me in this endeavor. One very important visit was the one I made to the Richards Group. Stan, you were very familiar with our program and you had always supported us by being a guest lecturer, working with creative faculty in final critique, and by sharing your expertise with us, and therefore, it was really important that you would be willing to support my idea. I had my speech carefully prepared. I started talking about the benefits of having a chair in our program, and I finally asked you whether you would consider making a $1 million gift to establish the chair. As I completed my sentence, I was interrupted <laughs> by our friends Lanier Timberlin, who stated enthusiastically that a chair would certainly not be enough. And our department should consider raising $10 million to name the school after you. It would be an understatement to say that Lanier's proposal caught me by surprise. <laughs> <laughs> the idea, however, was so exciting and it was so fitting to have a school of advertising and public relations named after Stan Richards that I did not hesitate and agreed with Lanier, with Lanier wholeheartedly. You did not miss a beat. <laughs> And you said that was a great idea. I will be eternally grateful to you for agreeing to help me in that endeavor. Because of you, there was never a doubt in my mind that we would succeed. You work with me every step of the way to raise an endowment in your name and your gift and your support made this possible for our dream to come through. Stan, I know you would always say that you give back to a place where you could see it doing what's good. Thank you for believing in us. Thank you, Stan. Isabella, thank you for all you've done for our school and all that you continue to do. And Stan, thank you again for your generosity and willingness to name our school five years ago. As Jay said earlier, we all endeavor, no matter if we're students or faculty or staff, to meet your standard of excellence and expectations every day. So thank you. And now I'd like to share the big news about the future of the Stan Richards School, which we are calling the lab. The genesis for the lab was in early 2018 
when Stan was generous enough to share some time with me and also his perspective on how we could help all of our advertising and public relations students become more industry ready, to have more fire in the belly, to really meet ambiguous challenges with enthusiasm and creativity. We also talked about the importance of giving students a feel for what an agency life can be and how an open, collaborative, egalitarian working space can contribute significantly to creativity and excellence. So we designed the lab to meet that brief. Specifically, the lab will help our students become more industry ready by doing more repetitions of client work, and it will be within an open, collaborative working space to hopefully enhance and improve creativity. So the result, in essence, is a student agency that will be a required part of our curriculum, and it will operate in an amazing creative space that will be worthy of the Stan Richards brand, because it will also convey the feel and substance of the Richards group. But why try to describe the lab as a concept when a video can convey <laughs> so much more? And for the first time, I'm thrilled to publicly share with you a virtually rendered concept, video tour of the lab. That's pretty awesome, right? Rock on. Stan. With your generous gift to create the lab, your impact on student careers, lives, and the industry just got a whole lot bigger. In years to come, thousands of future industry leaders from the Stan Richards School will be able to trace their career lineage back to you and your generous time, talent, and gifts. On behalf of those future leaders, together with our faculty and staff, thank you, thank you, thank you. We will be and are forever grateful. Will you please come up and share a few words? Well, everybody else had a prepared speech. Uh, and this is a surprise to me, and I, and I won't be very long. Since the subject of Lanier Timberland came up, uh, uh, I should tell you what I think is, is the funniest line that I have ever heard at a funeral. <laughs> uh, uh, Lanier died, I don't know, five, six years ago, something like that. And I went to his funeral, uh, which was in Dallas, uh, and there was a big crowd there, an enormous crowd. And the rabbi who was in charge of the whole thing um, had this great line. He, he said, um, everybody knew that Lanier Timberland was a showman. He was an absolutely great showman. That's the way he ran his career, the way he did everything. And, uh, and unfortunately, uh, he died just a day or two ago. And the day after he died, they shut down the Ringling Brothers Barnum and Bailey Circus. <laughs> and I thought, what a great line and what a great thing to say about anybody who had been in the advertising business. Uh, I'm getting a whole lot more credit than I deserve. First of all, uh, Isabella was, uh, was highly instrumental in, uh, in, in starting this relationship. Actually, not starting it because it had gone back a long way. 
but in, in, in getting it to the point where uh, I was as involved as I am today. So thank you, Isabella. He, it was <laughs> It, it, is, it is a great pleasure for me to be a part of this uh, and to, uh, to spend the day with you uh, as I have every year for the last several years uh, and to get to see the work of, uh, of several of the outstanding students, uh, to get to talk with all of you um, and give you some sense of what we're about, to have uh, uh, the great people from my office uh, come down here and have a chance to participate in a panel. And thank you for, uh, for doing that. Uh, that was very helpful. Uh, and, uh, and I just love being a part of what goes on here. Um, and it's not just because you're a great school or because you, uh, you have captured the uh, appellation that says this is the best school of its kind in the country. Uh, I, I love the idea of being around all of you. Uh, being around the kids who are the future of our business. Uh, there's, a, uh, there's an excitement, there's an energy that you all generate that is, uh, is not available any place else at any other time in any other school. So I, I am proud to be a part of that. I thoroughly enjoy uh, uh, getting to visit with as many as you, of you as, as I have today. And I'm just delighted to be a part of, of this effort um, to particularly uh, to build a lab, uh, which uh, in looking at the, uh, at the video that was just shown, it has a remarkable uh, resemblance to the Richards Group. Uh, <laughs> it, it looks a lot like our place, and, uh, and that was uh, not an accident. So thank you for having me. Thank you for uh, uh, providing that, that energy, electricity, and vitality that I so much enjoy. I appreciate it very, very much. Thank you so, so much for coming. Let's all give Stan one more really big round of applause. <laughs>